alongside outfielder Chris Andrews. I'm Joey Jarzinka. A 3-1 to one victory in favor of the North Fork Ospreys as they take down the West Hampton Aviators by a score of 3-1. to one. Chris Andrews, uh, you went 2-3 for three here this afternoon. You had an RBI single into center that scored Mason Kelly. Talk about the impact here this evening for you guys. You guys got your second victory in as many nights. Yeah, we started off uh, pretty slow uh, to start the season, but we started, uh, we came out here look pretty hot. We uh, tied against the Tomcats earlier this week, and then we had our first victory yesterday. So coming into here pretty confident. We were just trying to look and get on base and try to knock some runs in. Keep in mind, your starting pitcher, who also is your teammate at Monmouth University, mm -hmm. Jake Fryer, went five and a third, four strikeouts, allowed only one hit in 83 total pitches. Talk about his performance here this afternoon. I was actually surprised by his performance. He, <laughs> he, he, he in inner squads, he usually shoves it to me. He gives it to me pretty well. So I, I was happy to see him giving it to somebody else finally. <laughs> talk about tomorrow. You guys come back here. Another primetime game that will be live at 7 p.m. on the Hampton Collegiate Baseball League Radio Network against the South Shore Clippers. They are in a little bit of a slump. What can you do to keep this winning streak alive for you guys? Yeah, we saw them, or we saw them last weekend. Uh, we had two games against them, dropped both of them. So we're just looking to get a little bit of revenge. Maybe we can uh, get on the right side of the performance here tonight or tomorrow. Chris Andrews, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much, and we'll see you tomorrow against the South Shore Clippers. Thank you.